that in a second but basically I'm just going to be giving my thoughts on I got some stuff wrote down here uh, watermelon party for the Nintendo Switch uh, a little history real quick I just bought a Switch well actually my girlfriend bought it for me for my uh, birthday as an early birthday present but I just got it a couple days ago and I've I went on the store and there's like a whole bunch of games like super cheap on sale so I'm like I mean I'll, I'll just buy them all and give them all a shot so then I figured uh, maybe I should just make some videos on them. Uh, so here I am doing that. So yeah, so I went in the store, Watermelon Party. It was uh, like 90 something percent off. It's normally $4.99, it was three cents. So I'm like, three cents? Are you kidding me? I don't, I've never even heard of it, I don't know what it is. I'll get it. So I got it, um, I tried it out. Me and my girlfriend played it for maybe like 15, 20 minutes. So that's the only, the only experience I have with it, and that's part of the reason why I don't want to call this a re review, because um, I feel like I haven't played the game enough to do like an official review, so it's basically just me going to be me giving my thoughts on it. I'm not really sure what to call it, and I'm already a minute and a half in the video, so let me just get into the game. So, it's uh, at least two players, so you have to have at least two players. Um, and basically, I don't really know how to describe it, um... Yeah, maybe I can try to um, put some like gameplay on the screens to kind of give you an idea what it is. But uh, this is this this is gonna go horrible because I can't. I'm not really well. I'm not really good at describing things. So um, I'll try to make some of these videos. But if they don't turn out well, I might not do any more of them. But let me know what you think, anyways. So yeah, I'm already two minutes into the video and I haven't talked about the game at all really. So basically, um, you're going against each other. You gotta like kind of like put um, like blocks, not blocks, but like uh, tiles in front of you to like for your path to figure out where you're going, like uh, it'll be like a straight path, left, right, like whatever, and you have to get uh, these watermelons, usually there's a bunch of watermelons on the level, the first one to get all the watermelons wins. Um, it's not the greatest game, I don't even know if I would call it good, it's got some like weird issues that like I feel like just some of the mechanics don't work as well as they should. Um, but for what it is, I enjoyed it. I feel like for three cents, it's definitely worth it. For four ninety nine, I would say definitely not worth it. Um, I would say, like, anything under if you can get it for under a dollar, I would say it's worth it. Just a waste time for maybe, like, if you have a friend or friends, waste time for like, I'd say probably like up to a half hour, maybe an hour at most, is the most you're gonna get out of this game, and then you're probably gonna be done with it. But definitely, f um, if for three cents right now on the eShop, I think it's worth it just to try it or just to have something else to play if you're running out of stuff to play. Just waste some, waste 20 minutes. Um, so yeah, that, I guess that's going to do it for this video. Um, not really much else to say about it. But yeah, those are my thoughts on Watermelon Party for the Nintendo Switch. See you guys in the next video.